Hi, I'm Marisol. Welcome back to my channel. Today I'm planning for our, uh, January 9th through the 15th and this will be a birthday spread because my birthday is on the 9th. So I am going to use Feels Like a Sunshine Happy Planner sticker book. I've gotten this a while ago. It's bright, it's colorful, and I wanted something bright and colorful for my birthday. I also want to pair it with a Celebrate. And I also have Life is a Party, just in case I need um, some stickers, you know, birthday stickers, basically. Um, so right now, I'm just going to go through the sticker book and kind of start collecting um, stickers and kind of fast forward through that part because I didn't want to bore you guys with me just flipping um extensively through the sticker book and grabbing stickers i am pairing those with mojo jojo's plant and as you can see uh my black sticker book has uh some scribbly on it that is my baby isabella who also <laughs> likes to write on my sticker books and yeah it's tons of fun around here she I, i've mentioned this before she loves when well, when she sees me in my planner area, she loves coming by and also getting into stuff, which um, I found that she has written on a few of my sticker books, which now I will not be able to use that props on pictures, but that's okay. So here I am. I started with the sidebar. I'm kind of going through my washi to kind of see what um, actually kind of uh is close to that pink and this is the closest one that I found although it feels um warmer than the actual pink on in in the sticker book the that pink feels a lot cooler so um the other thing is uh I thought this would have been a quick and easy spread. It's very um speeded up and I did end up um cutting out a lot because um I realized that I have never made a um birthday spread in my catch-all for myself. Um usually uh planning with bumble does it and so yeah um this is the first year i believe since i started planning that i'm doing my own birthday spread uh so i did struggle a little bit with it kind of trying to figure out what what where, how to place things where to place thing i'm still um trying to get used to the classic size although i feel like this spread compared to my previous weeks uh, turned out a lot better and i'm not sure if it's because i you know didn't do a whole lot of scene just use one sticker book well mostly one sticker book um i did kind of use the um the other books to kind of um get some more um decorative stuff for um birthdays but besides that i mainly stay on the sticker book and that quote box is so crooked um i'm noticing it now i hope i change i hope i fix it i'm also editing this video um sometime after this plan with me but since i've already recorded i thought i will uh, put it up anyways so here i am like i said i i struggle kind of a little bit i wanted to add those but then remember that it's my birthday and that i need a box for my birthday so i do kind of move some stuff around i start with putting those boxes on the top but because I had already moved and placed them and I think I ripped one of them I went and got my undo and um now I'm just gonna grab a bigger box a full box and I'm gonna set it there 
for my birthday and I'm going to place that cake right in the middle. It's not centered. I do go back and move it and place those balloons. I believe I got from the Celebrate sticker book. Um, it has some other pinks, which I thought would be okay since um, this does have like some very light and dark pinks that it would go well here. So here I am uh, just putting my boxes and I wanted to do some clusters. So I add that group of boxes there and add this quote to of um, believe in yourself. I had a hard time aligning the quote because uh, the in yourself seemed to be lined up but not the believe. So yeah, I kept looking crooked. Um, I do believe, however, I move that because it's too high. And so now here I'm moving around my sidebar after I started um, with that. I think it's because I didn't want a quote next to a quote. So I'm going to put that long box on the top part. And I'm going to move the boxes around and the coat on the bottom. So here I am. Um, I'm adding some more boxes. I know that I do kind of a big cluster on that side and then there's not really um, a box for Monday besides for my birthday um, and I left it like that I think it looked um, it looks a lot it looks cute like that um, and I thought that if I need a box I can always add something later on so it doesn't necessarily have to be on that day so now I'm taking these quotes. This is from the Feels Like Sunshine sticker book. It's just the um, line quotes that kind of, I feel like it brought it in, like brought it together um, because there wasn't a lot of black, but that kind of um, moved some black into um, the spread. And so now I'm going to add another long box on that other page, on that right side of the page, um, just to kind of balance what I have on the other side. I don't always do that, but because that is that side box or a long box on the sidebar is colorful, and I wanted to bring that over to this side as well, um, I decided to um, use the long box. They didn't have a full box. Maybe if they would have had a full box, I would have used that. So that's why I went with the long box. So here I am. I'm just doing another cluster on this side. And I, at first, didn't like how that yellow box looked, but... After um, kind of moving it several times around, I just um, left it. I think it turned out cute where it was at, and so I just left it as is. <laughs> so here I am just moving on quotes, and I'm sorry, this is like out of um frame a little bit i am trying i move my planner space and i feel like i continue to move the camera um away from me and that makes it harder for me to plan because i need to extend my arms and i'm not that very tall so um yeah i am needing to kind of figure out the camera mount situ situation, which I do have one, a new one coming in, and I'm hoping that will kind of solve the, the issue with the camera. 
So now I'm just going to add that quote to the bottom, which is follow your heart. Um, because it's clear, I wish it was in paper, but it's in clear. I'm just going to um, white out that line that's right in the middle. And I'm going to do the same with the quote up here, um, just because it kind of looked a little... Um, like it was going through the paper so I didn't want it to distract from the quote so now I'm just adding a few headers here and there and pretty much this is my spread I did contemplate adding another it's okay quote because they do have different things but in the end I just finished up with a few headers um in those like really white blank spots and I kind of um move around especially the foil to the sidebar So this is pretty much my spread. I am going to put them on my planner so you can see them on my desks. Um, here is the end result and I think it's pretty cute and I'm going to enjoy writing it in this week. Um, so thank you so much for being here, for watching. Thank you for all that have subscribed and those that continue to come back. I am super grateful for you to be here and if you want to see more of my content please come and visit me at an in instagram at my little planning corner and i will see you on the next one thank you so much for watching you guys take care and bye